Well, hello, Scorpio. Welcome to Sin the Moon Goddess channel. Scorpios, we are here today to do a reading for you for November the 29th through December the 5th. This year is already gone. All right, Scorpios. Now, Scorpios, if you haven't noticed or haven't taken a look, I have uploaded a December reading for you. And the reading is under your element. And your element is water. So, if you look under water, you'll find your reading for this for December. I, I still will do the weekly and and also the um, singles. I just added one more. All right, Scorpios and Scorpios. Please. Okay. If you can help me out by subscribing to my channel, the Send the Moon Goddess channel. Wow. A lot. We only need one more spirit. <laughs> oh, okay, you can do that by clicking. Thank you. Clicking to the right. Okay. Thank you, spirit. And thank you, Scorpios. All right. At the bottom of the deck is the chariot. You're going to have to move forward. Scorpio, it's time to move. I think I told you that in your last reading. If not this one, it was the singles. It's time to go. All right, let's go. Let's get it where we are right now. Oh, wow. The Ten of Wands. We feel like we have too many burdens on our back. We have too many things to do, too many bills to pay, too many this, too many that. Come on, breathe. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Okay, our challenges for the week. Hey, a communication is coming in. Or are we traveling? Are we going somewhere? Scorpios, focus for the week. Wow, the Ten of Swords. Can we get out of these tens here? Wow. Ten. Now, I feel this is someone is talking or reacting to something. We're going to have to clarify this because this is a challenge and this must be rushing in. A recent past. Oh, the seven of pentacles. Um, are we getting what we work for? I work my eye. I'm, I'm just here and I work my ass off and and this is what I get. I mean, okay. Our strengths for the week is we do know how to let go of things. Do we, Scorpios? Or do we need to learn how to let go, surrender? Have faith. Let go of the past. Have faith. And our future. Gee, Scorpios, what's going on? The Five of Swords, we're overthinking. We're trying to come up with a strategy, but we're just thinking a little bit too much. Uh, approach of the week. Wow. Is that why we're thinking so much? Because we want to ask someone to marry us? Or re-engage, I'm hearing, and you're wondering if you should marry them. I'm just saying. That's what they said to me. All right. Advice for the week. You do have passion for them. And you do love them. Our hopes and fears. Ah, we're going through a, a change, but it's going to be a positive one. And I think you're a little worried. Looking at this board, it looks like you're worried about the new change. All right. Okay, our outcome of the week. 
Mm. Wow. Okay, when it comes to love, Scorpio, you ain't, hey, you're doing pretty good. You got choices. Yeah. You have choices. There's no problem when it comes to, to love. You have choices. You even have a, a choice of someone you know that can give you stability. Okay. But you are in your head about this, this change. This was all of this up here is about. Okay. So let's back it up a little bit and see what this eight of wands, what is rushing in spirit? Can we find out please spirit? What's going on with Scorpios? Mm. Okay. Oh, I forgot the signs. You you have a lot of fire, so you you, you got to be dealing with some Aries, Sagittarius, and Leos. Sagittarius just showed up again, and then this is Capricorn, Taurus. <clears throat> I see a lot of Capricorn. I see a Libra. Okay. Yeah. See Taurus too. A lot of Taurus. All right. But Scorpio, you're you're wondering if you're gonna get up, get what you put out. You you saying you working hard. You working very hard. And am I gonna get back what I put out? Yeah. And then you want wondering this relationship you in, is it toxic? Is it toxic? And it looks like it's 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 some it's a relationship not it's a travel here. It's some kind of travel in here, the devil please. Yeah, it's something that you're planning to go see someone or you're planning to see you want to see someone and you gotta travel to see them. But you all up in your head about it, about this travel, the ten of swords. That's what it is. Yeah. You're all up in your head about this travel. Yeah, you're overthinking it. You're overthinking this travel. They sent yeah, they send you overthinking this. They you you might as well go on and make make the choice. If you're ready to make some money, make the choice to do the travel. Mm, mm, mm. That's right. And it's somebody you're passionate about too. That you really want to marry them. And you want to give them a fresh start. And it looks like um, either a Taurus or they have it in a chart or, or a fire sign. Like I said, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. But it's, you have a lot of passion for this person. This person has a lot of passion for you. And you already know that they, they you guys together can have a very stable home. A very found foundation you've been knowing this person for a bit and you want to give them a love offer but you have the crossroads you don't know if you should offer them. wow scorpios yeah they're saying you're worried you're in your head about your about this new change coming along this is a new opportunity too there's already been um this you have already addressed someone already came to you or you went to someone else about about this new idea that you have okay but you worried about it for some reason and and the spirit wants you to know don't be because they're going to help you this is sagittarius energy again you got a lot of fire a lot of passion like somebody it, with a fire sign is really in your life and on your mind. Okay. But they, the spirit is saying they, they're here to help you. Yeah. They, they want you to have abundance. Now, some of y'all have abundance when it comes to, to, you know, the opposite sex or the same sex or whatever you're into. You know, I don't know. But you guys have choices and they want that balanced out too. Okay. So, um, yeah, I'm hearing you're going to have some more cloudy days, sorry, before you have that sunny day. But that sunny day is coming, but you have to do the work, Scorpio. Yeah, yeah, you got to do the work. You got to do the planning. You got to do the planning. 
the research. Because some of you tr want to open up a business and, and it's saying that you, you have to do the work before you can get the sun, the, the, you know, the happiness. So you have to do the work. And I'm hearing this, this is concerning a business. So if you do the work, the planning, the research, you'll get that victory that you're looking for. Yeah. Yeah. Some of you, you need to um, tap in, 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 in your inner self when it comes to your soulmate. If you want to have victory with your soulmate, you're going to have to tap into your inner self to come up with the answers that you need to get to your, your soulmate. Now, your, your, your soulmate could, could be um, a Gemini, a Leo, a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah, but this is someone you haven't been speaking to in a while. But now it's time. It's time to go forward. Not only with this person, but it's also time to go forward when it comes to um, your career. But definitely some of you are gonna going to meet someone new. And you're going to know right away that this person is for you. You're going to know right away. Okay. They want you to go forward with this, with this love. Yeah. Some of you are going to come up with a new idea with, concerning something that you love, like your passion. And um, it's going to make you money if you come out, if you come with it, if you bring it up front. Yeah. Some of you are going to be with this person that you're in love with for a lifetime. Your lifetime. Okay, Cancer. It could be a Cancer. Um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah. Just have patience. Some of you guys are not going to see this love coming towards you. Just have patience. It's coming. And so is that opportunity to make that money. You're saying they have patience. Scorpio. Leo again, um, Virgo. Uh, I also see uh, Aquarius just popped up. Yeah. Oh, it's going to be new star when it comes to your money. See, if you listen to that idea, they said they're going to have... <laughs> If you don't listen, it's going to have to be like pushed out. <laughs> like, you know, like you're going to, it's going to, it's going to be like a surprise and you go, oh, somebody's going to mention it and you're going to go, oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, 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 that's right, yeah. I do have this idea about blah, 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 something like that, yeah. But when it comes to love, I'm telling you, some of you guys are going to meet somebody new and it's going to be your soulmate and, you, and it's going to, this person is going to make you happy. Yeah, this person's gonna make you very happy. Wow, sevens is gonna succeed. Nothing but happiness and, and success. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh my God, it's still home at me. Okay, marriage. Okay, it's gonna be marriage. Babies, homes, money, opportunities. Okay, some of you guys are with someone that's older than you or you older than them, but it's not your usual couple. Okay, it's not your usual couple. Okay, it's not your usual couple. It could be someone younger or different race. Okay, but it's not going to be. They said, they're saying, um, you, you're looking for love in all the wrong places. Okay. Yep. But it's going to be a new start when it comes to love. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> it 
going to be a new, a new love coming your way. Some of you, especially the ones that are single, ones that just broke up. That's why you have to let go of the past. You got to let go of this feeling. Am I going to get what I really deserve? Because you are. When you let go of all of that, then you're putting out in the atmosphere of love. And love is going to come towards you. Yes. Love and passion. Love and passion. Love and passion. That's what I'm hearing. Ooh. Not only as a partner, but in your, your career. Yeah. It's a new start. It's a new start. You're being rebirthed. Rebirthed. Go for it. They're saying to go for this rebirth. You're being rebirthed. New love. Even if you marry, your love is going to feel like it's brand new. Okay? Even if, if, you, if you don't have anyone, you're going to meet someone. It's... And, and, and even if you're not looking for someone, you're going to rebirth in your career, your job. It's going to be a rebirth, period. Yeah, I'm hearing whether you want it or not is coming forward. So if you're not looking for it and it's going to hit you aside your head, you might not get what you want because I'm telling you, it's going to be a new day for you. A rebirth. In love, in money, career, and one of your areas of your life. Yeah, and I'm hearing is if you come out with that idea, I'm telling you, you're gonna make money and you're gonna feel like the star. Some of you is your soulmate. Sagittarius, Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You it's your soulmate. Your soulmate is coming through. For some of you others, it's, it's your career coming through. Yeah. Love, baby. Love offer. Work offer. You're going to be able to, you're going to have opportunities to choose. But they, they saying you have an idea. They want you to come to bring that idea forward because it's something you wished. You wish for it and your wish is coming true, Scorpio. Take advantage of your wish. The divine has brought you. The divine has brought you your wish. Now they want you to go ahead. Choose it. Oh my goodness. God. <laughs> Man. It's going to be a new day. You, marriage. Balance. Celebrations. Okay. A new day. Marriage, balance, and celebrations. All right, Scorpios, that's what I have for you today. That love offer is coming, and so is that money. The divine is in it. It keeps saying the same thing over and over. I just turned the cards over, saying the same thing. All right, Scorpios. I am send the moon goddess. And you know, before I let you go, I got to ask you to like and share this video. And if you haven't already, please help a girl out and hit that button over there to the right and subscribe to send the moon goddess. I am send the moon goddess. And I'm out, Scorpio. Have a good weekend.